Hello everyone, in this lecture we will discuss about the shortcut distillation using DWSM. So the problem is uh, the problem is related to the ethanol water mixture. We have also solved this problem in the SPAN HISIS. In this lecture we will solve this problem in the DWSM software. So the problem is uh, a mixture uh, of ethanol, a methanol, uh, ethanol water mixture, ethanol water mixture. Ethanol water mixture. Ethanol water mixture having molar flow rate of 1000 kmol per hour. Enter to distillation column at one bar and 30 degree centigrade. The light key component and the heavy key component are ethanol and water respectively. And their composition in the top and bottom, in the bottom and top are one person. So the 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 composition of uh, uh, ethanol in the bottom is 1% and we want 1% uh, water in the top. Uh, the reflux ratio to the column is 1.5 and the condenser and reboiler operate at 1 and 2 bar pressure respectively. So the condenser pressure is 1 bar and the reboiler pressure is 2 bar. The question is how many minimum and actual number of stages are required. So how many minimum number of stages will be required for this distillation? and how many actual number of stages will be required for this distillation. What will be the optimal feed stage? What will be the minimum reflux ratio? And uh, what will be the condenser and reboiler duty using uh, uh, shortcut distillation in DWSM software? After this, we will use uh, the data uh, of shortcut distillation and we will determine the condenser and reboiler duty for detailed distillation column, column using DWSM software. So first of all, we will open the DWSM. We will cre click on create new. Now click next to continue. So cl click on next. And here there are two components, air compound. So there are two compounds, one is ethanol and the other is water. Ethanol. Ethanol, ethanol, the second one is water, ethanol and water, it is added, click on next, there are in the quick spin Robinson, so I am using the NRTL, non-random to liquid, click on add, it is added, now click on next, add the system of unit, so I will use the C5, Click on next, click on finish. Now, first of all, we will use the shortcut distillation. So, go to the column and here select the shortcut column. Drag and drop it. Now, click on the field. Use the field. This is the field. So, this is stream number one is the field which is entering to the dis shortcut distillation column. So this is field. Now, the field, this is the input stream condition. So the temperature and pressure, the temperature is 30 degrees centigrade. Ethanol and water mixture is entering to the distillation column at 30 degrees centigrade and one bar pressure. One bar pressure. The mass, the molar flow rate of the mixture is 1000 kmol per hour ok go to the compound and the uh, what is the composition of ethanol and water so the composition it is 40% uh, ethanol and 60% uh, uh, water so the uh, ethanol is 40% is ethanol ethanol 40% and water is 60%. So ethanol is 40% and water is 60%. So 40% mole fraction of ethanol is 40% suppose and water is 60%. Click on accept changes. Okay. Now this is the top. So this is the uh, this is the top uh, top product and this is the condenser energy. 
So this is the condenser energy and we will and this is the top product and this is the condenser energy. Okay. The steel number two is the top or distillate. So this is the top or distillate. Distillate and this is the condenser energy. You see condenser energy and now this U2 is the reboiler energy so it is QR the boiler duty and steam number 3 is the bottom product bottom product now and this is the distillation column shortcut distillation so I will use the shortcut shortcut distillation shortcut distillation column now this is this is the feed this is the condenser in the, uh, duty this is the uh, top product this is the reboiler duty and this is the bottom product now here this is the distillation shortcut distillation and here the feed stream this is the feed it is connected you can disconnect it by, by clicking this one the top this is the distillate stream is distillate and the bottom stream is bottom the condenser duty is QC and the reboiler duty is QR now the light key component and the problem it is given that uh, ethanol is light key component because the uh, boiling point of ethanol is uh, small as compared to the boiling point of water so we will consider we will assume that ethanol is the light key component and water is the heavy key component now the mole fraction of uh, ethanol in the bottom is 1% and it is equal to 0.01 it is ok and the mole fraction of the water in the distillate uh, uh, the mole fraction of uh, the light key component mole fraction in the bottom so the mole ethanol mole fraction in the bottom is 1% this is and the heavy key component in distillate so the mole fraction of water in the uh, top is 1% 1% water is in the top in the distillate and 1% uh, ethanol is in the bottom so the reflex ratio the reflex ratio it is given in the question that the reflex ratio is 1.5 reflex ratio is 1.5 it is okay now it is okay now the condenser pressure the condenser pressure is 1 bar the condenser operated 1 bar pressure and the reboiler operated 2 bar pressure 1 bar pressure and the reboiler operated to bar pressure ok now click on the solve button that is solved now here you can see that the condenser uh, duty the condenser duty is 10754.33 kilowatt the reboiler duty is 13908.44 kilowatt and what is the uh, h1 number of stages and minimum number of stages so the minimum reflex ratio is 1.48 or 1.5 about the minimum number of stages is 9.48 it is about uh, 10 the h1 number of stage is 35 the optimal feed stage is 16 the stripping liquid is this one kilomole per hour the rectifying liquid is this one the condenser duty is this one this is the condenser duty 10754.33 and this is the reboiler duty so this is this was shortcut distillation now we will use the value of this shortcut distillation to operate the uh, detailed distillation column so we will copy this these data in the we will copy these data First of all, we will make some new slides. We will copy these. We will copy this one and we will paste it. We will use these data later. So, now we will remove this shortcut distillation and we will add the detailed distillation so click on it and delete this shortcut distillation 
okay now go to the detail distillation here the detail distillation this is the detail distillation this e3 we will remove this e3 delete this e3 okay okay this is the distillate this is the reboiler duty okay now connect so this is the uh, this is the uh, detailed distillation column distillation column now we will connect so go to the specification go to stages okay these are this is the general so the uh, uh, absor the absorber operating mode so this is the uh, di distillation column so okay the number of stages so here the actual number of stages the actual number of stages which we obtained from the shortcut distillation is actual number of stages 35 so it is 35.14 but we will ignore it is 35 35 so we will put the data of short cut distillation 35 now the trace spacing there is no information but we will uh, uh, leave it by default the condenser pressure is 1 bar 1 bar minimum number of maximum number of attraction is ok now go to the specification the the condenser top is total it is okay the condenser top pressure the condenser pressure drop there is zero pressure drop the reflex ratio the reflex ratio uh, the reflex ratio there is what is the reflex ratio uh, uh, the minimum reflex ratio is this one actual number of stages to the reflex ratio in the question is it is 1.5 it is 1.5 okay now go to the this is the condenser now go to the reboiler now the reboiler in the reboiler the molar pro product molar flow rate you can use the if you information about the boiler pressure you can put it but i have information about the product molar flow rate so the molar flow rate here you can see it is a uh, 602.04 uh, 602.04 kilo mole per hour so 602.04 kilo mole per hour kilo mole per hour it is okay now this is specification the condenser reflex ratio is this one the reboiler is this one molar flow rate and the stages go to stages there are there are 35 number of stages one is the condenser and 34 is the number of stages go to the connection the feed so you can uh, this is the feed it is okay it is connected if this is disconnect so you can connect it now this is the stream connection now go to the stream stage association uh, this is the feed okay now uh, in the connection this is feed and now go to the product here the distillate is distillate it is connected the bottom is bottom it is connected go to the duty so the condenser duty is a qr it is reboiler duty so we will connect it to, to qc qc is the condenser duty and Q, uh, and qr is the reboiler duty it is connected now side draw there is no side draw it is okay uh, stream stage association it is now the feed optimal feed stage so what is the optimal feed stage here you can see the optimal feed stage is 16 optimal feed stage is 16 from shortcut distillation so we will connect the feed to stage number 16 optimal feed stage is 16 it is okay now this is the estimate okay this is the uh, results okay now we will connect these
This is a condenser. This is the reboiler duty. The reboiler duty. So this is the distillator. This is the condenser duty. So now to general and here number of stages it is okay now go to the solve button click on solve so it is solved now from detailed distillation you can see that the condenser duty is 289A2142 kilowatt and the reboiler duty is 3073.38 kilowatt so this is the detailed distillation this is the field here this is the distillation column the retail distillation column there are 35 number of stages uh, and the uh, condenser so here the reboiler calculated value is this one the estimated height of the column is 18500 millimeter so it is 18.5 meter long column and the diameter of the column is about it is uh, 4 4 meter is the uh, diameter of the column the condenser pressure drop is zero the condenser duty is this one so the number of stages this is the period here this is the distillate you can see the distillate uh, the distillate temperature is 80 degree centigrade and the reboiler temperature is 99.98 degree centigrade and this is the period temperature it is 30 degree centigrade you can see double click on this distillate and here the compound amount so this is the ethanol and this is the water now this is the bottom so here in the bottom the ethanol is very small and water is large amount of water is present so this is the field okay so then we should change it okay Click on distillate. So, this is the detailed distillation. Click on solve button. Now you can go to the click on distillation column and here go to the results. Here you can uh, plot the temperature pressure composition profile so click on this one this is the temperature versus stage temperature versus stage this is the, the this is the pressure temperature this is all information about this is the table this is the graph this is the this is the table this is the flow composition flow so this is the water ethanol water ethanol and stages this is about the molar molar fraction and stages composition flow molar flow temperature these are the graphs so this was all about the uh, shortcut distillation and detailed distillation in dwsm thank you very much for your attention if you are new to the channel please like and subscribe